Thank you for watching. This is our trip on the Sugar Express, which is a steam engine train out of Clariston, and it's about a two hour ride. There are several choices where to sit. This is the coach car, which we sat in for a while. It's air conditioning and very nice. Looking out the window, you can see the acres and acres of sugar cane. They're during the harvest, so you see fields that have been burnt, fields that are tall and ready to be harvested, and you can see some fields with stubble in it. This is one of the conveyor belts they use to load the boxcars as they pull up to get the sugar cane. We saw many boxcars with sugar cane along with trucks on the highway hauling it to the factory. Here we are crossing the canal that connects the Atlantic Ocean with the Pacific. And this is the first lock coming out of Lake Okeechobee in Moorhaven. So we have stopped. The engineers walked around to the front of the train and now they're pulling us back with the steam engine. As we're coming up on the curve, BJ blows the horn so people know we're coming. This is the dining car. While they were not serving meals, they had complimentary drinks and all types of snacks. You were not going to go hungry. We took a peek inside the kitchen to see what it looks like. And uh oh, the crew member left their hat behind. And here's some information for the train geeks. There's 170 miles of track between Seabreak and Fort Pierce for this line. It operated between 1952 and the late 60s. In addition to hauling sugarcane, it hauls sweet corn, green beans, kale, celery, broccoli, and cabbage. The train engine was rebuilt in 2020 and only runs to haul excursions now. Thank you for watching, and please don't forget to hit the subscribe button when you're done. Thank you.